I'm Laura and welcome back to LSB Designs. Today I'm going to be doing the second part of the mini pause. This one is going to be a ring pour using the same colours as last time but don't worry if you haven't seen it or you can't remember the colours because I will show you those in a moment. Before I start I just wanted to show you the results of the last mini pour I did, the mini Dutch pour and it looks absolutely beautiful so here you go. Look how beautiful that has dried and it's been given a lovely shiny top coat of resin. You can see how that sparkles, it is beautiful. I'm really, really pleased with how that's come out. So I'm going to get you back in place and I will show you my colours. Back in a sec. So here we go. So this is my little six inch canvas. It is a Loxley gold chunky canvas. So that's the nice thick deep ones. I have taped off my back and put my push pins in and I have made sure with my spirit level that it is nice and level. There we go. So the same as before, the colors that I'm using are the iridescent green blue sorry blue green the prussian blue titanium white the iridescent silver mars black and the pearl sapphire blue now these paints are thicker than last time and um, this is a thick mixture because these are going to be for a ring pour. Now because the canvas is so small it only needs just over two ounces of paint in total. So I'm just going to use my really dinky little silicon cup here. So it only holds a hundred mils in total and if you work in mils that it, I need about 62 and a half mils of, of paint. Now I know I'm going to go over that with my layering because it is such a small amount but I'm not worried about that. So here we go. So I'm going to start off with some of the iridescent blue green in the bottom and then I'm going to put in some of the Prussian blue followed by the titanium white This is the iridescent silver. Tiny amount of the Mars black, because I don't want a lot of that in. The pearl sapphire blue and then I'm going to finish off with a little bit more of the iridescent blue green and a little bit more of the Prussian blue there we go now we have got a very pretty looking cup and I'm going to start pour it for you
there we go and that looks so pretty in there really really pretty so I'm just going to use my handy dandy little torch and I'm just going to pop some of those air bubbles really quick and now I'm going to start and tilt it off and bring it back to the center and down to the other corner and bring it back and then down to that corner and back again and then down to the last corner and there we go bring that back to the centre there we go I'm just going to wipe my hands off quickly because I'm now covered in paint as well and I'm going to give that another torch that not only pops some of the air bubbles but it's also helping bring up some of the cells in there so I'm just going to have a quick look around and I can see that I'm missing a bit of paint on a couple of my corners so I'm just going to scoop a bit up off this, what's dropped off onto my mat and just placing that back on so we don't have any bald patches so I want the whole canvas to be covered nicely A bit on this corner I'll just turn it around quickly so I can check this side and that all looks good so what I'm going to do now I'm going to use my little silicon spatula and I'm just scraping all the way around the edges just to get off any of the excess paint that is dripping down because we don't want it to pull the paint from the top down the sides because that will spoil the very pretty design we've got going on on here. So. I'm going to bring you down now so you can have a closer look. Here we are. Look at that shimmer coming from the iridescent blue green. It is absolutely stunning. And there are lots of little cells popping up. So pretty. And I love the lines. It's got a pretty little center and the way those stripes come off with the lines is absolutely beautiful. I'm really really pleased and I can't wait to see when it's dry and resin because this is going to be absolutely gorgeous. So there you go, that is the second of the pause all done. So thank you very much for watching. If you like what you saw, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and that way you will be notified every time I upload a new video. Please leave a nice comment, that would be great. Thank you very much, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.